The world's first full screen fingerprint reader for LCD screens is ready. Mm. This is a thing that I actually tried out a really long time ago that never showed up in devices in a big way. And it wasn't a full screen reader, but I tested out, I believe it was a Vivo device with a huge area you could place your thumb. And you could put two, two thumbs. And you right? could, you remember yeah. this. Yeah, yeah. We were in China. Yep. Was that, that felt, that feels like 10 years ago. It wasn't, but it was a while ago at this point. It, it was expensive. It never made its way into uh, consumer devices, but it was very convenient to not have to look where you were placing your thumb for the in-screen, in-display fingerprint. Well, apparently it's going to make its way or it could now make its way into consumer My devices in the form of this new technology. And this is from a company called FortSense Fort uh, or Tianma, sorry, uh, from Tianma. They presented the world's first full screen TFP fingerprint solution. They managed to make the entire surface of a screen a single scanner, removing the need to aim for a certain area on the display with your finger. And that's on an LCD display, it looks like. Is there any images? Not loading. The only image we have is at the top. You see, it's a full screen fingerprint. <laughs> okay, Look at that. That's like the image you would use for a sci-fi yeah. thriller in 1997. Mm-hmm. And it's scanning with the gradient. Either way, I can speak from experience that this is some pretty cool technology. Even when it was half screen, full screen, I don't even know why you'd need it. I guess the orientation wouldn't matter. But I've actually experienced this and it's incredible. So if it does come into or make its way to consumer devices, in my opinion, from a convenience perspective. Oh, there it is right there. You just found the spot. Yes. So this is where I'm registering it. Press hard. Incredible. That's so, uh, so long ago, man. And look how big the touch area is. Wow, Will, you found that fast, man. This is a moment in time. I remember it because, man, it was such a cool phone. The Vivo Nex. Vivo Nex. Full 100% screen to body ratio. No notches. And that was a while ago. Crazy. Mm -hmm. Anyway, maybe we'll see this make its way into actual consumer tech now.